Hello friends, today we are gonna tell you that how you can create page navigation inside your Power BI report. Since I am creating one attrition report and I need one page navigation, I want you to learn uh, with me. So first we will take the button, uh, just a normal button inside the insert tab. We have element section and that there we, you can take the button. Okay, now we have taken the button. What you need to do now, let's change the color of this fill section and you change it color according to your need. Okay, then you can change the color and you need to get rid of the border now. Alright, we are gonna supposed to change the, uh, we're gonna make the corner a little rounded. Let's try it. It is too much rounded. I don't need this much. So let's reduce the size of this and then we will see. Let's do it little less because it is still too much. All right, this is done now. I think it is looking fine, but let's keep it 12 pixel. Now it's fine. So now we are supposed to do, um, let's fix a little height of it because it is looking uh, a little big. So let's keep it uh, in the middle of this uh, white background as you can see. Okay. So now, now what we are supposed to do is we are going to add the icons at this. You will go to icon section in the custom. You will find the icons. Icons I have created in Figma and you can also try guys. Ask me if you want to know like how you can create it in Figma. It is little easy because since we have already given option there, you can see and it's easy to just change the color and export it in your system. So now we are going to make it adjust because I want icon should be look in uh, I icon should be adjust in the left side all right I want to adjust the size of this icon 25 around 26 let's see how we are gonna do that in the icons we have given the icon size from there we can adjust it okay I think this is looking nice this is looking okay um, we are supposed to make it three buttons right three buttons since one should be show like yeah it is selected and two others should be visible as a default buttons default in the sense like these are not selected if you are for example if you are on a particular page then what it is show it will be showing you that yeah this page is selected and others two are not selected so we are gonna we are not gonna fill these buttons last two buttons uh, but I will just add one icon inside this so so that it will be looking good uh, now I have done that okay so this is a good feature guys like adding icon inside that button it gives a little more um, appealing things in the buttons um, okay so let's do it for another one i am creating three buttons one is for overview second is for income and the third one is for user so according to that you can choose your buttons how you want to take it do you want to take it like um for other things for to show the charts you can take according to that uh, to show the charts and like that now okay we can adjust the size now and what else what i need to what do you think that it is somewhere that is missing so something is missing is the text we are going to suppose we are going to add the text also so that it is clear okay this is the button and it is showing you that thing a particular thing now i have added the income users all right and uh, i am gonna change the uh, I need to take a button. Um, I need to take the color of that icon. I want to keep the same color for the text also for the the one I'm using for the icon. So income and for users also. I'll keep the same but let's adjust the size of this text a little bit so that it look good. For user also we will change it. For users I am creating like that. And now I will add one icon inside that inside this overview one also let's keep it white only since we are not gonna uh, keep the color as you can see it in the default button so okay now it looks fine let's uh, play with a little bit with the size of these text because i'm not uh, satisfied with the size of this 
income and users overview looks fine but still like income and users are not that good so now it is ready to use as you can see so these are you can add according to your need if you have four page navigation you can add four bar four buttons if you have six page navigation you can add six page um buttons so you can do it according to your need all right so i have created these three i have created these three so guys so that it is visible according to that income if you are income then income should be selected if you are users then user should be selected like that thank you thank you for watching see you in the next video bye